school. Been there, been there. See my little ten day tape and my dumb rats. Don't call it impossible. Fidget Spinner and GTA 5. What? How you guys doing today? My name is Hernando. Welcome back to the channel. Today's video, we're going to be talking about the Fidget Spinner in Grand Theft Auto 5. Because yes, you can actually play with this thing in the game. And no, I'm not joking. This is all 100% legit. And before we actually get started with today's video, make sure you guys don't forget to go ahead and subscribe to my channel and leave a like. I'm going to be hosting a PlayStation 4 giveaway to my subscribers. All because we reached 2 million subscribers. I'm going to be giving back to you guys guys so if you want a playstation 4 drop a like on this video and subscribe to my channel do not forget to go ahead and do that and then you're automatically entered a chance to get the actual console don't miss out you have a chance to actually win so how about we go ahead and begin so just in case you guys have no idea what's a fidget spinner it's basically a stress relieving toy and it's been advertised to help people who have trouble with focusing or fidgeting now of course, people have been using it even though they don't have trouble with focusing. They've just been playing around with it. And I promise you, you can't go out anywhere without seeing some type of kid playing with one of these. Now, very recently, you know, a bunch of people have been making a bunch of videos on fidget spinner tricks, different type of fidget spinners and all that type of cool stuff. You know, it's really awesome, but it's been to a point where everyone's just been using them just because of the hype. Now, of course, this thing was designed for people with ADHD, autism, and anxieties. But of course, again, people just use them because they're just cool things to play with. You know, all that type of stuff. But, you know, aside from all that, let's just focus on over towards fidget spinners and video games because there have been migrating over towards that. For example, right here, for the few of you guys who actually don't own a fidget spinner, well, you can go ahead and technically still spin away. All you need to go ahead and do is download this fidget spinner app where basically you just spin and that's pretty much it. Kind of crazy how there's even an app for this. Now, another cool thing is the fact that over on Minecraft, there is a crafting recipe where you can go ahead and make your own little metal fidget spinner which is pretty pretty awesome and this has been taken over even in call of duty what oh my god dude like right here over on the pc this dude got a freaking crazy trick shot while holding a freaking fidget spinner what the hell is this oh my god those guys over on pc are freaking beast man but it doesn't actually stop there because if we go over towards his secondary weapon he actually has a fidget spinner right there just chilling but it could be photoshop i'm not too sure and as well over on Lito, you can actually go ahead and throw some fidget spinners to go ahead and kill off some evil doers in the game but again it could be photoshop so i'm not too sure on that now it's about time we go ahead and talk about grand theft auto 5 because yes it has went ahead and migrated over towards this game and i absolutely can't believe it but yes it's actually in the game guys now no rockstar did not update the game where you can go ahead and actually buy your yourself a fidget spinner in the nearest convenience store no it's none of that but you can actually get it by using a mod now what's cool about this is the fact that they actually got the fidget spinner and they put it in the game like i absolutely couldn't believe it but it looks like this is actually the case so you can go ahead and spin it you can go ahead and use it as a weapon you can go ahead and just leave it on the table a bunch of very awesome and cool stuff that i really didn't think you can actually do but of course with the power of the pc and how you know flexible it is compared to the console you can actually do this now i don't want to go ahead and say that this is only 100 only for pc when i could be wrong of course there are mods over on the ps4 and xbox one but as of what i know as of right now the easiest way is to actually do it on the pc but if you're one of those guys out there who actually know how to transfer mods over on console which of course you can do then you can go ahead and actually do this but again pc is the easiest easiest way to actually go ahead and get your own fidget spinner now i do have some gameplay footage to go ahead and showcase to you guys all courtesy from another fellow youtuber known as super gash bell his link will be down below in the description for you guys to go ahead and check him out but here we are all the way in the convenience store now the cool thing about this mod right here is the fact that all you need to go ahead and do is just simply 
walk into the convenience store and just purchase the fidget spinners that you can actually get just by talking to the clerk in the front desk and there's also a fidget spinner in the back which is the weapon very of the actual fidget spinner which you can go ahead and purchase for yourself in the game to go ahead and attack people uh, I don't know destroy cars and pedestrians and all that type of stuff all you need to go ahead and do is just simply press E or actually go ahead and press the button to actually purchase shit and you can go ahead and buy the fidget spinner but yeah you can actually tell this guy sells it because he just has them right there advertised on the desk right here but right there there it is five dollars for the normal fidget spinner and 25 for the big fidget spinner i'm not too sure if there's actually a big fidget spinner in real life probably there is i'm not too sure but yeah you can go ahead and buy it right here in the footage we're gonna go ahead and be purchasing both of the actual weapons now the normal fidget spinner that we got right here you can't really do anything with it other than just putting them around your house and just just having them there just to chill and all that type of stuff but the big fidget spinner the 25 dollar one that we got right here is actually pretty cool you can go ahead and just lay this on the floor or you know if you have a real life mod like this one right here you can actually go ahead and place it in your car which is very very awesome and really really realistic we're gonna go ahead and be showcasing this right here we got our big old fidget spinner it's not gonna go ahead and fit in our pocket unfortunately so we're just gonna go ahead and place it inside our bmw oh my freaking god this is pretty pretty sick oh my god I, I really can't believe it now the normal fidget spinners like i mentioned before it would be really cool if rockstar actually updated the game where you can actually go ahead and uh i don't know spin them for no reason whatsoever like you know how you can go ahead and drink a soda to heal your health i don't know maybe just have the fidget spinner there while you're just idealing not moving your character whatsoever you know instead of your character just like walking back and forth or just you know cracking his nose knuckles he's actually playing with a fidget spinner while you're going afk this will be a pretty cool thing to actually do it doesn't really interrupt the game because of course you're doing it while you're afk and that would be a really cool update for roxy to actually go ahead and actually provide us with so right there we got the fidget spinner inside our garage it's just there chilling you can go ahead and grab it bash anybody you want with it and it's a very very deadly weapon if i gotta say because they got a bunch of melee weapons in the game but this just adds to another layer of it now right here we're gonna be going inside their house and like i mentioned earlier we're gonna go ahead and place the little five dollar fidget spinners that we just purchased right here in the shelf right by the woman right there and oh my freaking god i really can't believe this like this will be honestly a good idea for rockstar to actually go ahead and actually do you know just go ahead and just place your fidget spinners right there on the table or you want to go ahead and grab them and take them anywhere you want to or even trade fidget spinners among other gta online characters that would be something pretty dope that i do hope that rockstar will go ahead and later do down the line but right here we got a character just holding the green fidget spinner in our hand and something pretty cool about this fidget spinner right here the big old red one is it actually has a blade inside of it hidden now here with while talking about here we got some very sharp knives around the fidget spinner itself which does make a pretty deadly weapon if you actually you know went ahead and hurt someone with this but oh my god dude like a fidget spinner with knives that is something that i really don't want to go ahead and try out for myself to actually spin because of course it is deadly but this is just something that rockstar can actually integrate in the game if they want to go ahead and put the fidget spinner so how about we go ahead and take our weapon out for a spin so what we're going to be doing right here is we're going to be going outside and we're going to be doing some stabby stabby right about here uh uh yeah there we go yeah oh my god that is that is very deadly look at those dents on the freaking wall man that will be something very very painful to actually go ahead and get stabbed by imagine just going to the hospital you know the police is there trying to get an explanation from you and you're just going ahead and saying yeah i, I got i got stabbed almost to death because a guy was carrying a big old fidget spinner that would be a very awful way to actually die <laughs> but anywho who knows maybe rockstar will go ahead and actually add this to the game we are getting a brand new dlc update this month so let's go ahead and have our fingers crossed for that but anywho hope you guys enjoyed today's video if you did support it by dropping that blue thumbs up would be ever so much appreciative and as well subscribe to my channel if you're new see you guys later peace out and stay safe everybody
Jay Corsa the beat.